So my question is, are you saying that people that are born male can actually have endometriosis? Yes. Uh, when I say cisgender male, I do mean those that are assigned male at birth. Um, I actually got cisgender male from a doctor. That's the terminology that they told me when they were speaking to me um, after I got, you know, after I start transitioning, they said that they use that so that people feel more comfortable and understand it's easier for them to understand when they're taking their notes and stuff like that, not having to uh, misgender or, uh, you know, understanding things that could possibly okay. and stuff like that. But yes, yes, ma'am, uh, cisgender men do have endometriosis. They have been diagnosed with endometriosis. I have <clears throat> a couple of endo warriors that are my uh, supporters that have family members, their fathers, uncles that have had endometriosis. And um, thank you, Lisa. And then there's a couple of literatures that express uh, the names of those cisgender men, where it was located, how their symptoms were shown. It's mostly found on like the um, the bowel area, the groin area when it comes to the cisgender men and stuff like that. So. I, I mean, and I'm not trying to be funny. I've seriously, I've been a nurse for 30 years and I know that someone said they've been a nurse for 19 years. Had you guys ever heard of that um, man getting it? I, um, the nurse down there that's been a nurse for 19 years. I, I'm, I had never heard of that. I, I seriously had not. Yeah, actually I have a lot of uh, nurses and doctors that come and comment on my, on mm -hmm. my, um, my content and say the exact same thing. I've had an, I've actually had a nurse that wanted to argue with me really bad. So I had to, go back and get you know get the documentation that i that i found it showed it it has everything that's that's there and yes it is mm -hmm. it is legit research it is actual facts i have actually talked to doctors in the hospital that have worked with these cisgender men that have had that have endometriosis it's wow. it's actually it's it is a thing it i mean um just from 2018 it was a uh, since 2018 16 cisgender men have been diagnosed with uh, endometriosis. And I've heard since then the number's up to 28. So, you know, it's not that it's rare. Rare, okay. Yeah, I, I, I say that all the time with endometriosis. I try to get people to understand that endometriosis, it's not rare. I do not, in my belief, I do not believe endometriosis is rare in cis women, cis men, and people. I do not believe it's rare. I believe it is ignored. 